Baymax Collection Edge of January 4, 2024. I have quite a few to show here. I cannot test a single one of these because my Baymax player does not work, so... I will not be able to play these until I get either a new Baymax player or if I fix my Baymax player. But let's just get the video started. There are six other Baymax here that I'm not going to show in this video because one's a duplicate and the other five I have no interest in. But I'm going to show the ones I am, I am keeping. Rated M, although this will really be rated R. Oops. Bag one on the back. Bet is gonna have nothing at the end. Some more than this one, but I was able to clean it off. Booty A figuring that in a nine. I have volumes one and three on each chats. The number four ninety two. Well, the print still fell off, but I was able to um read the print day. Forty four freaking nineteen eighty four. Don't care about this at all, but I will keep this tape. I would not have kept this had it been the beat shots. Exclusive to see by MTUA Home Video, but I very highly doubt the MTUA Home Video was shown at the beginning of this tape at all. September Boy of 94. Back on now, because I put that tape back in the case. This always did not come with a booklet, but I saw cases of babies as copy I got rid of. And this is the very first Baymax tape I ever got. So many is coming with VHS cases. This always did not have a cage, but I put this inside this VHS case when I got one of my VHS copy and the end label fell off and half of the front label fell off. Some of these labels fell off over time. This order came in two separate tapes when I first got it, but I saw the tapes. I saw the cases. In this case, in case the ornament came from a VHS copy that I got from a VHS thought that I did not keep. The newest Baymax tape I have, this one, 1990. Some movies I do not have on VHS yet, like this one. This has some more on it when I got ready to clean it off. The 6 96 and the tape is damaged at the beginning. It's missing a piece in the phone strap. March 9th, 1985. August 30th, 1984.
This replaced my VHS counterpart as I had when I got this. September 1896, because I have the MGM silver top piece of this movie. This tape, um, this, the labels are inside. This tape is just like from Alien Manic Video. Last one coming to be says Kate. And now on to the rest of the tapes. That come in Baymax cases. Forty-first week in nineteen eighty-eight. Where was for all? But the point was, but the point was September tenth, nineteen four. Oh, so the case is going last. Ninth week of night night four. Here's an extremely rare Baymax tape. Unfortunately, I cannot test this yet, though. This part says, please do not rewind after last use. $60 when it was released. March 1st, 1985. July 30th, 1985. So, 18 years after my birthday, but I was not born for another 14 years. Twenty second week nine four. Rebel fell off. Anyway, we're still intact. And this is the coin figures from Tim and tape inside the RCA coin figures from video case. And I do need to find a copy. Of this with the actual CPAC case in. Fifty second week of nineteen eighty six. The... Hold on. The 40th week of 1984. I finally read the week in your corner save. And now that I'm doing this video. Seven week of Fell off. First week of nineteen eighty five. <laughs> No wicked year code or print date at all. January 22nd, 97.
No print date. I have a duplicate copy of this, but I'm not showing it in this video. This is the copy I decided to keep. 10th week of 1985. The tape was kind of broken when I got it. Well, actually, it wasn't broken, but this actually has some mold on it. But I cleaned it off, so... The... This part is sliced off, but the print date was September 12, 1985. April 18, 1986. We have a few more with cases, and then we'll get on to the ones that do not have cases. July 20th. No, July 10th, 1988. Let's see. August 27th, 1994. April 25th, 1996. October 1992. February 10th, 1994. And this is the last tape I'm sewing. The Hazard Kates. 4996. And now we get to the rest which do not have cases. I have another copy so we just still later. July 20th, 93. This is the NBC copy. Do you have to get the MGM Contender Classic Beast out of the movie sometime? I was able to rewind these manually. October 20th, 1983. March 1st, 1995. 12th, 1995. March 1st, 1995. The same print day is CC and Company and Together. Where was I missing? But this is Hollywood Boulevard. It was 2093. And the it's recycled, but I cannot tell though yet. No print date. Canon Pictures Error, but this is an MGM movie. July 26, 95. No print date at all. No print date either. 20 seconds we not in five. Not to be confused in the 96 movie starring Mel Gibson. July 4th, 1984. Not to be converted to Child's of Five Disney movie or sequels. No print date. And not to be converted to 998 movie by Tony the Fox or the Child of Twelve movie either. August 21st, 1994. Real dirty over here, but that's alright. Seventeen ninety four. First week nineteen ninety eight. Fourth week nineteen 
Bruce Bruce Chicken at five. Here's the next video copy of Colin Arts. If only I was able to watch that movie, so. Well, the Baymax counterpart of it, both my copies. February 6, 94. The number 9th, 94. No print date. It was 26 and 5. We're almost done. No print date. Got 5 left. Booty 8 thing that is free. This turns a little damage at the beginning. Not so you can see very well or not. The last tape. That's my Baymax collection.